Stakeholders in the education sector are calling on Nigerian students who study abroad to return home and contribute to the nation's economic development. They made this call at a briefing in Lagos. They noted that many professionals who acquire education and work experience abroad eventually return to Nigeria to serve as technocrats in government, becoming ministers or political appointees. We need to encourage the idea that young people can go out there and acquire that global education. Now, what they decide to do post-graduation is left to them, based on their personal aspiration. For a lot of folks, 50% of the time, they always return back to Nigeria. And we always get to see that they are the guys that are able to access better opportunities in blue chip companies. They are the guys that are able to launch out better startup ideas, innovative ideas. But more importantly, these guys are likely the guys that get to work in government because of the exposure they've gotten. So Those places we are going to go and study were sometime like what we are today. So, but if we as citizens and those who are in authority become intentional and committed to it, at some point in time, um, Nigeria will also be a part of the places that others will come and study to go back to their various countries. We are talking about um, uh, uh, repatriating knowledge, skills, and abilities and people. So, which is good. At this point, I'm not sure if Nigeria needs anything, you know, more than that. It's a good thing that uh, the engineering profession can leverage on, and which will also bring something very good to the society at large, especially the educational, educational sector. This initiative is very, very novel. If this initiative has come 30 years earlier, maybe people like us will have key in. So it's a very, very, very novel initiative. 